Welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for all Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising. I, I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Please remember to listen to the general readings and also your Sun, Moon, and Rising reading because they're going to help you in a lot of ways. Okay. As we look at the energy vibration reading that is coming out for you guys in this month, you have the energy of uh, this month is the energy of the devil. And this is the general energy for this month, the energy of the devil. And as we look at the energy of the devil in this month, it's going to change a lot of aspect, a lot of stuff that has been going on, a lot of stuff that has been um, um, being all over the place, a lot of energies that has been leaning you know, all over the place, and a lot of situations that has been happening. You're going to see a wonderful situation of structure of energies that are coming in. So, um, we're going to understand where we are and we're going to understand that there is a sort of a um, energy vibration that is coming in which we weren't expecting and we weren't aware of and um, this is going to change it has been something that has been going on uh, sometimes it's stop and it's out of um, vibration and sometimes it comes back in so this is when it comes back in and you need to look at it your focus is going to be finding um, the inner strength to, to get through the situation your focus is going to find the inner strength to get through the situation whatever situation whatever however it is affecting you your focus is going to be finding that place within you to find that situation to really heal that situation whatever is going on so your focus is going to be um, the eight uh, the inner inner strength is going to be your focus inner strength is going to be your focus and you need to understand that with this inner strength that you're going to find it is going to help you to move yourself and align yourselves as we look at the first week we have the week of the lovers which is a water energy and the week of the lovers bring you in the energy vibration of the eight of cups in reverse and the eight of cups in reverse is a situation where you are looking back at your relationship and you are having nostalgia and you're thinking was that a good idea and you're really looking back and um, now you've gotten over it in this week you will get over that looking back and realize that you need to elevate yourself and you need to move forward okay so you have spent some times looking at a situation for some people I'm seeing in business and in work and you're looking back and then you think okay you know it's uh, I've learned a lesson what is my lesson that I've learned here and that sort of a thing and then you will move yourself out of certain aspect and certain situation it's as if for some people with relationships is as if there was a relationship that you had to turn your back on or walk away but it was a good relationship and now you're looking back at it and you're wondering what have I done and where am I supposed to go and which direction am I supposed to take now and now in the first week you're going to stand up and move towards that direction what we have in the first week also with your chakra energy you need Need to find your solar chakra and heal your solar chakra you need to find your shoulder chakra and heal your so your 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 so your solar chakra because um, you need to find back your inner power you need to find back the energy and your inner power to this situation whatsoever was happening here you have another energy of the moon and as you connect with the energy of the moon what will happen is that you will realize how beautiful as you connect with your higher spirits and guiding angels because the moon is always your intuition and the moon energy and the energy of the moon always bring the psychic Kick the unseen world so as you connect um, with the unseen world you will understand and ask them to help you to let go of this situation and look at the lessons that you have learned and the people in the situation and see every situation that has ended as a karmatic situation that you had to clear karma with these people whosoever this person was or organization or groups of people but it has something that you really 
um, had a connection with and you needed to let go because there was a lesson you were supposed to learn something and uh, um, the people who you connect with why you felt such a broken heart was that it was people who you know from lifetime and lifetime before but you have uh, ill and cleansed whatever was going on and it's okay so now you can move on to something much better in your life as we move on to the second week the energy of strength comes back in the second week which is a fire week and the energy of strength have the two of cups in the reverse so the energy of strength have the two of cups in the reverse so um, whatever that was happening in the first week it is playing also out in the second week the two of cups is in reverse there is an end to a situation with two people there is a huge end with a situation with two people and this situation it is the six of cups so it is six of cups I am using my glasses the six of cups is in reverse so it was uh, uh, as I said in the first week it was a karmatic situation with people that you came back in this lifetime to work out and um, you um, it's, it's you know you you have cleared it and you're moving on and you should just see it as um, a cosmetic a, a cosmic situation a situation that you bring from lifetimes before back um, into this lifetime to clear so you have cleared it and you're moving on because you come out being richer as a person and um, you the message that you needed to give you have given the message and um, you 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 did it with grace and you are moving away and walking away from something that is below your level this is so good but at this time you need to find joy um, this is second yellow energy so you need to find joy you need to find that joy within that you have cleansed that karmatic situation and you're moving away from that sort of a thing and that karmatic situation comes up and you're realizing how because it teaches you something whatever um, has happened and has transpired between you and this person the situation this organization whatsoever had transpired um, between you and this organization the situation and the, the it, it, it was an, an, an past life situation it is now in reverse and this is good when it's in reverse because you are finding your energy it was a negative situation for you it was a situation that you needed to cleanse on a, a spiritual level and you're moving away and you you know you're moving to something which is better which is so much better and so much understanding and so much situation that you're going to realize how wonderful and how powerful this is because um, you can see what is happening to a lot of things and what really transpired so this is extremely good this is a place where you should be glad that you made this and that you are aware of certain aspects and now you just move away and you have clear understanding of whatever is going on okay so you know you are um, you're at a place now that you are at a place at cleansing and healing something with a past life situation past life people as we move on to the third week we have the energy of the Empress and we also have the energy of the princess of cup the energy of the princess of cup and the energy of the princess of cup is our um, energy vibration um, that comes up and uh, this energy of the princess of cup is you know she's vibrating on a, a sort of an energy that she's sitting and she's looking at something and she knows that something isn't right so um you if you are between the ages of 18 and 35 this affects you in the third week if you have the energy of um the the energy of a mother who is from an earth energy vibration this situation now is going to be a renewal in your relationship with this person so if your mom is bit if you are between the ages of 18 and 35 you're going to connect with your mom and there is going to be a renewal and healing of 
a situation in your life and if it's not your mom it's going to be someone who you can connect with who understands you it is as if a mother figure someone who you have disconnected with you're going to go back and connect with her at a higher energy level vibration and you are going to have a, a renewal of something in your life and this renewal is going to help you to move yourself to some place that is much better you're going to have an understanding of certain aspects and you're going to move yourself out of negative energies to something which is very beautiful in your life okay so you're going to heal a situation with someone who has been very very um, helpful to you someone who has been so transparent good to you someone who you're connecting with at a full level energy vibration that you're saying to yourself um, I need to reconnect with this person that is going to happen in the third week in the fourth week we have the energy of the Emperor the energy of the Emperor um, you will receive extra gifts these are not um, or you may be giving out gifts so you can be receiving extra gift or you'll be giving out gifts so this is a sort of an energy vibration that um, is going to happen in the fourth week so um, it can be that someone of a fire sign will be helping you um, with little elves or you know and 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 this sort of a thing this fire sign person is gossiping about something and there is a gossip uh, and 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 um, uh, gossip is actually a negative energy art space vibration, and whenever people gossip over you, you the gossip can turn out in a good way because when people hate you, what happened is that. The, that sort of energy and that sort of a situation bounce right back and then you see and you feel yourself in energetic and vibrating at a higher energy vibration so this is extremely good so then you realize how you have a situation that is happening in your life and with the energy of gossip people gossiping over um, what you have that sort of a thing or what you you know they're gossiping because um, you had it before you don't you no longer have it and they have to help you so they're gossiping or uh, it can be your father that you ask your father for money and and he's going on and after talking over it before he can help you and that sort of a thing at the end of the day you will get the help but you know sometimes when people do this sort of a thing then it brings so an energy vibration that you know it doesn't give you a high energy vibration so be aware of this so this sign of situation is going to be coming up in the fourth week and you need to understand that you need to you know forgive people because you know people find this uh, sort of a thing and this sort of a gossip and this sort of a thing people who gossip have lower energy vibration honestly if you gossip you have lower energy vibration uh, honestly I always say to people you know if you if you are so tied down about this sort of a thing you know just tell the person if you know how you're feeling so the renewal that is going to happen in the third week because I'm going back to the third week because I the energy of gossip comes up so the universe is telling you to stop with the gossip the universe is telling you to stop with the gossip okay all right we are going to look at all the weeks in an overall view in the first week we have the energy of the lovers in return you're looking at a situation a disconnection from a situation you're understanding realizing moving on and your angels and guides will be helping you doing that in the second week we have the energy vibration of the six of cups in the reverse form and the six of cups in the reverse form is joy 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 because you had to help some people clear up uh, and past life uh, situation and you came in there is a transformation so you're leaving that situation behind and you're moving on to something else you are going to connect with someone of an earth energy vibration and this is going to be a female a strong female um, 
um, passion position that is going to go on and this is going to elevate your life there's going to bring a renewal and whatsoever that was broken down the end of a negative situation is going to come to an end and this is going to be extremely good as we move forward we see the energy vibration of um, of um, the, the fire sign a man a fire sign man who is gossiping and making a lot of uh, um a lot of chaotic situation it has to do with a child it is all over a child it is all over but this child is very spiritual this child is extremely spiritual and what people do not understand is that um, if you gossip and break and try to break down the energy of a spiritual child it only bones back to you like people who um, sit and and, 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 and negatively speak bad about other people and 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 try to break and they sometimes they don't know how powerful their words are and the person who they send it out at it's going to just shatter it and and, and shatter it and send it back to them so this is why I always say to people be careful of what you said your words are very strong and powerful your words are very strong and powerful and if you say say something to someone and it comes out as if you say to someone you're a very dishonest person then um, it is that your angels and guides in the universe put it in you to say to you to say to this person that that, that this is an information this is a message that you should have brought to that person and you did so whatsoever is happening a lot of gossiping is happening over somebody who is very spiritual and people who are spiritual and kind and have a clean heart it's going to bounce back to the people who are sending it to them and a cleansing is going to come in this is a wonderful powerful reading I want to say to each and every person out there remember that your words carry strong energy vibration be aware of what you send out in the universe because that is what you're going to receive and what is happening here is that there is a beautiful energy that is uh, um, coming up and this energy is going to help you to, to transform certain things and certain aspects in your life what is going to happen is that you're going to move and elevate yourself to something at a very stronger energy vibration and in this way you're going to see transformation of a whole lot of things going on and by this you're going to realize how important it is that you change the energy vibration of certain things and certain aspect that is going on so you know be aware of what is going on understand where you are and I'm saying namaste until next month